Good morning, YouTube friends. This is Lisa and Star Song Studios. And as usual in the morning, I make a, a few yo-yos, my yo-yo design wall. And then I'm going to try to do some different things. I don't know, take pictures, just pin them up there, take pictures, and then take them apart, reuse them. I'll make new ones, though, of course, too, to add to my collection. But I just finished having my retreat. My, my retreat, January 20. 21 of 2021. So this is the year that we can do that. Have two days together, 20th and 21st of each month. Most years, they're not going to be together. Like last year was 2020. There's no 2020s. You know, there's no two dates alike. So last year, what I did was the uh, the 20th of each month and uh, uh, corresponding with the month, like the 1-1-2020, 2-2-2020, <laughs> so forth. Anyway, I just want to tell you what I did on my retreat. Some of the things. I babysat both days, so I didn't put that on here. But the 20th, of course, was the inauguration. And Melanie and her family came over. We watched that. Introduced um, my little, my youngest granddaughter, Emily, to a puppet I had. It's like a jack-in-the-box that I call Horace. It's a little clown. And his name is Horace. Because he's hoarse, he can't talk. I He just nods his head and coughs his hands. This, anyway, she had never seen him before, so I did that. I worked on Yo-Yo Design Board. I told you that already. I drank instant coffee and had a spa evening. Uh, this year, starting in January, the first, on <laughs> the first day of January, I didn't have any coffee or tea for like the first two weeks at all. And then I started drinking some tea. Um, uh, hot tea, and then um, the twenty, the nineteenth, the nineteenth, my husband brought me home um, a coffee from McDonald's, a, a caramel latte. So that was my first coffee. Actually, it was on the nineteenth. But me, I usually have instant coffee every day. Well, yet yeah, uh, the twentieth on my retreat, it's the first time I had instant coffee for the year. And then I had some yesterday, and I have some today, so I'm I'm done fasting my coffee, I guess. But anyway, I had a spa evening, so it's my little retreat. I wrote two songs. I write one song a day, normally, a song or a poem every day. But on the 20th, I wrote two, and on the 21st, I also wrote two. And on the 20th, unusual for me, I slept until 6.52 a.m., and I jumped out of bed thinking I was going to babysit at 7 but I, when I check my text, where usually the lady I babysit for um, text on my, on her way, she said that Bebo was sick that day, and so he wasn't coming. So I'm like, oh. then my other my other kids come at eight 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 and eight thirty, so I was okay. I was good, but I was like freaking out. I was like, man, because I don't oh, I don't normally oversleep, so I guess I really um, was resting up so I could have do more that night. On the twenty first, I fasted from six on the twentieth, six o'clock in the evening until um, six on the 21st, um, washed and styled my hair. And if you saw it yesterday, it was all curled and it was down. It was, I, I thought it was pretty. Um, had prayer at 7 a.m., but I do that every Thursday from your boat around the globe. I uh, babysit eight to four. I had, I made myself, since it was a retreat, I made myself do an online piano lesson. I was learning some new stuff. I wasn't teaching it. I was learning some new stuff, classical. And also, I, I did it. Um, a, I, I learned a new chord, E minor, on the ukulele and played a song. And I recorded that. Um, I finished reading the uh, for my podcast, the book Dream Shards. I do it on the podcast. I, that was my last day for that one. And I began reading a book called Anna Green Gables Devotional. And then I did that today on the 22nd. I did that as uh, my my opening for my devotional. Um, I worked on my yo-yo design board. I took off all the yo-yos. Remember, if you saw it, I had a queen-size mattress that I used in the back side of it, the bottom side. Uh, it wasn't a reversible mattress. It was just, you know, the back side of it had not been slept on. Anyway, um, so I used it for a design board, a queen size one. Had it covered with yo-yos. Well, I take took them off, and it took me a long time to take off all the yo-yos. I had them all pinned in, even the little tiny ones, little dinky tiny ones had pins. 
in them. Anyway, took all that off, and then I just um, tacked up some blocks, yo-yo blocks that I already had made and made a um, couple designs, but it's not done. I still have more stuff to do on that. But the main thing I did is clear off the old one. And then my daughter Melissa called. We don't talk on the phone very often. We don't communicate a lot. She lives in Hutchison, Kansas. Well, she called me yesterday, so that was special. Uh, I played the accordion. I did a video of it. Played the song, He Touched Me, the uh, Bill Gaither gospel song. It's called He Touched Me. And then I found out that Rachel Dodge, my um, my book, The Anna Green Gables Devotional, she has racheldodge.com, racheldodge.com, and for kids, got like worksheets and stuff kids can do. I began reading the a Victorian Christmas Brides collection on the uh, Oslo during my retreat. Today, yesterday, at 9.21 Central Time, it was the 21st hour on the 21st day of the 21st century, uh, year 2021. So that was kind of neat. Um, I also did a peony flower arrangement. I found out I love peonies. I love them. I thought they was a type of rose, but they're not. They're similar, but it's a whole different, whole different flower. And I found some new music and quilt pages online. Also, a reading music jazz channel. I found a, jazz, a soft jazz channel on YouTube that I can listen to while I'm reading. Multitask. Um, and I found some other pages of some people that sing really good that I like to, that I want to check out, listen to some more. And um, I, I found an art page called Louise's Pictures. And I found a couple of quilt pages that I want to follow as well. So anyway, that's what I did on my retreat. I'm making yo-yo, waiting for my girls to babysit to show up. Have a good day. Bye.